I'm going to draw the mouse and the motorcycle. First, we're going to start with the helmet. And it's a half circle. It's out like this. And in. And then a lip that comes out just a little. And then a chin. And it comes up right about here on the helmet behind the second half of the helmet. This drawing is a little harder, so be patient. This is the arm. It swoops down and around to about where the lip is. And then it curves down for the hand and back up like this. Now we're going to do the back. The back goes out <clears throat> and this comes down below the paw so come down here lower and then go around like that. Curve line that goes this way. This is his leg and then it goes like this. His foot curves around this bar which we'll draw later. That's his foot. And then this big swooping curve back up. And then his, his chest there. Okay, there's two lines for the helmet. And then his eye is coming out from underneath the helmet, a great big eye. Draw a circle there to hold the white spot. Little polka dots by the nose and some whiskers coming back. Okay, now we're gonna <clears throat> draw the tail. It swoops up, it kind of makes a nest shape. And then it comes back down like that. <clears throat> okay, now for the motorcycle. Right underneath here, it comes down and goes straight in this way. And on the other side here, is the rounded shape of the front of the motorcycle. In his hand, there's the bar, so there's a circle there, which you can color in black. And then out the other side is a uh, kind of a rounded stick. From here, draw a line that goes down just a little ways. Just about to the past this. On the front of this is the headlight. Which goes all the way down to the middle of the wheel and comes back up. All right, this curves over and attaches here. This curves down and down and we're going to stop there for now. <clears throat> We'll draw the front wheel now. This is the fender. And it comes out this side. Draw a line here. Just the edge of the fender. draw that shape. Okay. Now there's a red circle that goes around here. And now the tire 
just try to draw the best circle you can. And then another circle, just in a little bit for the rim or the wheel. And then another circle really close to that one. Then a partial circle. And then some lines. The kind of lines you see when a wheel is spinning fast. Yeah, it's not perfect, but for some reason I'm kind of shaky today. So, back over here, we draw this funny shape for the motor part. And then underneath there's this two slanted lines in and then lines going across. Okay, from here there's a pipe that goes out and down. Down to where his foot is and it comes down past his foot. Okay? You can draw a circle right here for the peg that his foot's on. And draw the other side of the pipe. That. And here there's sort of like a hot dog shape. And then more pipe. And back here in the back, there's a pipe that goes down the other side. So we just draw part of it. Okay, right here, there's a big shape that goes behind his leg. It's bigger on one side and then it gets smaller on the other side. There's another pipe that goes across here. Now we draw the back wheel. This fender comes down, goes up, over, and down. And then a line that follows this here. That's the fender. And now you want to draw a wheel it's about the same position on the road as that wheel. And another circle shape inside that, and then another. Okay, and then there's a dot in the middle, circle around that, a line that comes out and behind that, down and over. And then this just has a partial circle and some lines too. On the back here is a tail light like that. Okay. Now, um, I also have stripes, you know, to show he's going fast, coming from different places, his tail, that, motorcycle, and then some lines here in the dirt, 